Hey again, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to reduce or decrease your pH using liquid muriatic acid. Um, and this is what you need to know to lower your pH using muriatic acid, uh, 0 0.2, you're going to use about 12 ounces per 10,000 gallons. Now, if you want to lower it 0 0.4, simply double the amount. You double the measurement, so double the amount, and that's going to be 24 ounces per 10,000 gallons. If you have a 20,000 gallon pool and you want to lower it 0.2, you double the gallons, so simply double the amount. Um, so this is pretty self-explanatory. This is your baseline. This is what you need, and it is, it's going to be your best friend when you're lowering your pH. Now, uh, being that you're dealing with muriatic acid, safety first. Uh, I wear glasses so it really doesn't do too much to me but uh, be sure that you know you're wearing long pants uh, and you always want to add the water or I'm sorry you want to add the acid to the water not the other way around. So just take your bucket and fill it up with about halfway full of pool water. Now I'm helping a friend out, I'm going to clear up her pool, but I just wanted to make these videos. Um, the pH is already 7.4, seven, uh, seven I think it's 7.4 or 7.6, so I'm not going to lower it, but I'm just going to walk you through a, of how to do it. So you take your muriatic acid and you simply pour it in the uh, uh, bucket and you have a PVC pipe right here. This is a stir stick and you can pick these up at your local hardware store, you know, just for a couple bucks. So, what you do is you just mix that up in there. Now this is going to have acid on it, so you don't just want to put it down on the deck because you're going to bleach that out. That's why I have the bucket here. So you stir it around, take it in, rinse it off like that, and then just set that aside. And now you have your mixture in the bucket and your pump motor needs to be on while you're lowering your pH. And simply bring the bucket down and just walk it around the pool like that all the way around the perimeter. Then after you make the adjustment take your broom and sweep around the perimeter very very well. That helps helps the acid get mixed up with the water and the water can absorb uh, the acid and that'll lower your pH. Be sure that you keep the pump motor running um, and you don't want to take a, the, another test one or two hours afterwards. That's a myth. You want to wait for one full turnover of the water, which is normally around 10 hours. So you allow to filter for 10 hours and then take another test and then make another adjustment if needed. So that's it. That's an easy way to lowering your pH. Uh, check out the description box below. Lots of great information um, in there and also on my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. So I'm Robert with this channel, Clean Pool and Spa. Like, subscribe, and comment. Uh, so I think that's it. Be safe and happy swimming. Bye.